Hey guys, it's Kim here and welcome back to One Life. A very happy hello to you. Uh, so here I am in my home. Uh, I've actually updated my uh, texture pack because I remembered that I there were a few textures missing. So like on some of these ores and things like that and on some of the trees. Um, and then I remembered that the Yogscast Complete server that I ha uh, we had for Nana's Village and all that had a very good complete uh texture pack. So I've used that, which is also now why I have my Nano's uh, noodle ball uh, cursor, courtesy of Will Strife. Thank you, Will. Um, so what are we going to do today? So as you may have noticed, um, I kind of have uh, a couple of hearts missing. That's because while I was offline, um, uh, well, not offline, off camera, I was making a couple of um, improvements to the area. So as you can see, now I've kind of made this pathway down into the village. Um, so very nice, took me a while, but I uh, enjoyed it, and I lit it up with all these uh, pumpkin um, jack-o'-lantern things. A technique I stole from Shin, I won't lie, so I've made this very nice path going all the way up here, so people should be feel like nice and invited. Lit it up with the jack-o'-lantern um, lights, um, but unfortunately what happened was the server was a little bit laggy at one point, and when I was in this back area here, uh, well, I might as well show you because I actually got footage of it because I recorded it, you know, just in case something happened. Something did happen. Right, there are creepers in my garden. I need to get rid of them. Let's go out. Boom, 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 boom. Right, sit down. Oh no, crap! <gasps> oh my god. Whoa. Rip farm. Server's a bit laggy. Oh, look, there, there goes my house. There goes my house. That's uh, that's fine. That's fine. We can fix that. We can fix that. You know, it's not like those uh, windows were expensive or anything. Okay, so I've just about fixed all of that crap, like from from creepy gate. Oh wait, there's another one. Right, piss off, you bugger. I've had enough. Yeah, you. I'm talking to you. I've had enough of you. Oh God, he's right there. He's no, 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 no. Can't say I didn't deserve that. Yeah, pro probably deserved that. Well, rip my house, my health, my bed, and my farm. I'll just be spending the next 20 minutes repairing this and crying quietly into my hands. Now, what I was going to, to do today was I was gathering resources to make uh, a bunch of Tinker's Construct um, bits and pieces because uh, I believe, I think it's Brit uh, has been working very hard. I can't remember if it's Brit or Lauren, I'm very sorry girls, um, but the, either one of them has been working very hard to make the smeltery a proper little smeltery area. So as you can see, working district. Um, so we've got that and then I'm not sure what we've got going on up here. Enchanting room, right, okay, so yeah. Um, so Dylan made an enchanting table and uh, I think he put it in the middle here and now they've decided to move it out so we can have like, where's that zombie grumble? Okay, uh, so yeah, it, it was there in the middle there but now we've kind of moved it out uh, to here which is a bit nicer because then we can still uh, still have the central area. Um, so yeah, uh, one of the girls has made this very nice uh, Lovely room. If I could don't, someone could donate and be a block to make some gold. Some gold to make a block. I'll love you forever. I'll share. Uh, okay, uh, I'll, I'll see if I can do that because what I wanted to do was I wanted to make a whole bunch of uh, Tinker's Construct, all of these basically, and someone else has already done it. Um, so that was my whole episode plan was look, I was ga gathering all the kind of stuff to make grout, um, then to make seared bricks, you know, I gathered it all up um, and I was going to make all these tables, but screw it. Someone else has already done it, so I might as well, because I feel really kind of, um, uh, what's the word, like, uh, in debt to people in the server for getting me to where I am. Uh, so, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to make a hammer, uh, go down in the mines, get some more resources, and basically try and make some kind of cool tools for everybody. Um, now, if you bear with me, because my knowledge of Tinker's Construct is a little bit rusty, um, but I kind of logged onto Nano's Village before this, where I've got a smeltery there, to try and remind myself, why is there a giant hole in my, uh, uh, to remind myself what to do. So it doesn't look like anyone's made any casts or things like that. So the first things first is to make some casts, we need some aluminium. So I'm gonna smelt up 
all this aluminium ore and um, we need to make aluminium brass. So casts can be made either out of gold or aluminium brass. Aluminium brass is three aluminium ore and one copper ore. Um, so I'll smelt up all the aluminium first and in the meantime I need to make some blank patterns I believe. Uh, so where do we start? We generally start repair and modification. So this is like the tool station so this is where we're going to put together uh, some bits and pieces. That's a stencil table so I need to put my blank patterns in there. Um, yeah this is because this is out of order so I'm not... There's one missing though. Tinker table and then there's Stencil table, so we've got the stencil table, and then we've got the tool, ah, the tool forge has not been made. Uh, so I can make that, so let's start, because everything starts with blank patterns, and um, they're pretty good anyway. So it was wood and sticks, but yeah, just checking around, there definitely isn't any tool forge in here, and I've left, is it night time? Oh crap, it's night time, is it night time? I, I can't tell. Let me just stick my head out. I'm really paranoid about like traveling at night time now. Yeah, it's night time. I'm gonna be staying in here then. Um, yeah, I'm so paranoid about traveling at night now, so it's just not a thing I really want to do. Uh, so we got aluminium in there and it's aluminium brass that we need. So I'm gonna put my copper in there. Thankfully, those are uh, a bunch of things that I got. Um, miniature red heart. Now I'm holding on to that. Um, because I want to make uh, a heart canister, but I need stuff. Um, so I need lots of things, basically. So I could actually do that. Uh, heart canister, empty canister, which is tin or aluminium. Oh, I could have just made it tin. Tin I've got, though, and a necrotic bone, which I don't have. Uh, or there's this one which is even better. Um, oh, that's a new one I haven't seen. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna hang on to those because that's a valuable resource to have. Um, so basically, yeah, what I wanna do, make a hammer, go down into mines, get some better resources, um, and yeah, hopefully not die. Um, so I need to wait for it to be daytime before I go down. Uh, down? Up, to get my wood and stuff like that. Very noobish, I did not uh, leave. Uh, without checking what time it was. Uh, so we'll see you in the morning. Okay, so I managed to make a break for it. <sighs> it was kind of rough. I'm surrounded by horrible things. Uh, but yes, let's start actually doing some crafting. Uh, so I got a ton of resources. Um, let's see, how am I gonna do this? Let's split it in half, there we go. Ooh, hello, Yummy. What you got? Uh-oh. Okay, let me get all those blank patterns. Um, where are you? Okay, so we made some blank patterns. Now, uh, if I remember, we put them into here, and then we need to make stencils. Stencil, wait, no. Cast. Wait, I can hear a... Was that yummy? No? Yummy? Okay guys, so I, I think I'm gonna stop doing this for a second and go help Yami out because she wants to join the village and she's out there on her own. So I'm gonna go rescue her and bring her here. Uh, so uh, be back in a second. This has been traumatic for me today. Okay, where, where are you at? <laughs> Oi, Min is out of looking at it. It's like, he might, it wants me. It, yeah, he's thirsty for you. He wants to kill me. <laughs> Please. I'm trying to... <laughs> It's really it high. Ball? I can't like, I can't hit it because he's so high up. Um, let me see if I can, I don't have a bow and arrow, so I might try and ransack someone's, oh wait, okay, he's come down. Okay, I'm doing this for you, Yami. Wait, no. <laughs> this is where you die and yeah, I yeah. Yeah. so <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm, I bet, I bet Scott's got some, some arrow, bows and arrows or something like that, so I'm gonna. Save me, kid. Um, I need to shoot it, I can't like reach it, so I'm gonna shoot, I'm just gonna raid Scott's house. And see, because he's he's got loads of stuff. So, uh, or is mob drops? It's got to be in mob drops. Okay, so there's some arrows. Uh, uh, I need a weapon. <laughs> Give me a weapon. Is it turning night as well? Uh, I think it is, but there should be a bed in that house that you're in. 
Yeah, so you should be able to just like snuggle up. Uh, damn it, he doesn't have. Uh... Damn it, Scott! I just needed one thing! Okay. This spider has nearly killed itself. It, well, yeah, it is jumping up and down. <laughs> yeah, he's. What are you. I don't. He just wants me, that's all it is. Yeah, he's just he's looking at you. He's like, I'm, look, I'm looking at you. I'm having you. I'm having you, mate. Oh! Yeah. Yeah, if he just keeps doing that, fun. he'll just kill himself. <laughs> he's, he's looking at me now. He's looking at me. Screw you! Yes! Die! Okay, one more drop. Yeah, one Ooh, more. No. One more of those. Yes! Oh, hey! hey! <laughs> we are <Yay>! free! <laughs> Finally! Oh, it's good oh, to be out. Oh my gosh. Uh, it is getting to night time though, so do you want to just borrow, uh, I think that's uh, someone, in, yeah, you borrow that bed. Oh god. Um, oh, good and do, do you have a bed on you? <laughs> No. Oh. I didn't get one at, at spawn. Oh, no. no. Sad times. Okay, you you sleep in that one. I'll run across and I'll grab someone else's bed. Okay. Okay. I can't rest. There's monsters nearby. I'm going to have to bed. Scott's one's probably quite good. Is is quite good. Yeah, he's over the, the other side there. I'm going to hop into Diaz's bed. Okay. Slip. There we go. These people have beds? Yes. Okay. Awesome. Oh my god, that was stressful. <laughs> <sighs> I lost a heart from that. That's my first oh heart. Oh no! I know. I just like freaked out when I saw the spider behind me, so yeah. I punched it in the face. <laughs> <laughs> just straight up punched it. Okay, now you can actually show me your house. I okay. I've seen it. Going on a merry mission. Come on this way. So yeah, I built a pathway up to it this way here. It's not very impressive, and I haven't finished building it, so. Yeah, don't, don't, don't hold your breath. <laughs> oh, I like these little jack-o'-lantern lamps. Yeah, lamps. so they're like Aww. my new thing. Oh, I'm quite proud of them. They're quite cute. So welcome. Adorable. Welcome oh. to Shake Him. Uh, so yeah, um, it's very simple and weird. And I just went for kind of like big old windows. So I could stare at everyone. And, very um, simple. Yeah. This is a very weird and complex shape. <laughs> it's just weird. <laughs> um, there will be an upstairs, but I've kind of holed it off for now because I haven't uh, had a chance to kind of finish that off. Okay. Mm, there's my farm out back. Oh, what? You have a personalized farm? Yeah. A little, little personal farm there. Wow. Um, yeah. And that's pretty much as far as I've gotten. I was just about to make some stuff in uh, Tinker's Construct um, so I can make some better tools and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so what are you going to do? Are you going to build in the village? Are you going to join us? I am going to build in the cherry blossom biome. Mm -hmm. Because I hate you all. I'm just kidding. No. I just wanted to, <laughs> I wanted to have like a really huge area. Yeah. Well, I think, um, Sherbles and Dylan are over in the cherry blossom biome, but also like Kaf and Nettie are going to come and join us, but then they're good. They want to set up like a system that connects everybody. Um, so like it could be good to have people a little further out so we can connect you all up with like mine carts and stuff. We can have a little transport system. It'll be really cute. Oh um, yeah. But yeah, I mean, if you want to take any, like I've got, these are kind of like extra things, not the bucket though, actually I need that. Um, but yeah, if you want to take, <laughs> take any, the bucket. <laughs> yeah, don't take my bucket. Um, if you want to take any resources to help you out, then go ahead. Uh, can I take this stone sword? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, you can take all of these if you want. Oh, sweet. Thanks. Taking it all. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Give a girl an inch and she takes a mile. <laughs> It really does. And she'll take everything you own. Yeah. Okay, right. Well, it was fun. Okay. I will uh, go build my house and okay. I'll let you come see it when it's cool. done. Cool. Yeah, well, give me a shout if you need anything. Okay. Bye. Hello, friend. Well, we managed to save Yami and she's off to build in the cherry biome, I believe. Uh, so let's get back to the exciting job of building stencils. So I was a little... Um, a little distracted earlier, uh, I was trying to figure out like why I couldn't see like the, the stencils here, and it's because they are there on the left, but they're very, very faint, um, so I can't quite see all of them. So they are there. That's why I was a bit like, why are my patterns giving me nothing? Um, so what I want to do is I want to build a hammer first, because that will give me some awesome, uh, blah, 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 what's the word? Um, 
it, it means you can mine like I think a block of nine by nine or something crazy like that and I think that would be really really cool but what we need for that is a tool forge um, so actually it's a kind of a good thing that I got loads of resources to start with um, anyway because I need to see the recipe for a hammer so we need block of iron oh my god two, four blocks of iron uh, three blocks of smelted bricks and a tool station so tool station is a crafting station and a blank pattern. Crafting station is just a crafting table. So let's get started. I'm gonna promptly forget pretty much everything. Uh, so we need a crafting table. And then uh, it was a tool station, wasn't it? So it was a blank pattern. So everything in like Tinker's construct revolves around um, this pretty much. So that's a tool station. And then, God damn it, I dropped my seared bricks up there, didn't I? Ugh. Uh, but I need, hmm, now here's the problem. I don't know if I have enough uh, iron for several blocks of, ah crap, uh, several blocks of iron. So I'm probably gonna have to steal some from someone. Sucks, but um, them's the breaks in this cut through. But the thing is, if I do pinch someone's iron, uh, it'll help in the grand scheme of things. Or I could just melt, I could just melt all my, um, all my stuff. Now, I gave all my berry ores to, uh, who did I give them to? Uh, I gave them to Brit, that's it, I gave them to Brit. And she has gone and made some orberry bushes in here. So we got essence, we got aluminium, we got tin, we got iron, but it doesn't look like, oh, we got enough iron ore berries? Uh, so I'm gonna raid this. Yes, no, I know it's, it's bad, I'm like raiding someone else's house, but there we go. Um, so incidentally, by the way, thank you for your comments on your last, uh, on, the, um, on my last video. Uh, someone mentioned, um, those orbery bushes make an underground room, plant the bushes at, on stone at low level light, and when they are grown, right click them to harvest them. If you smelt the berries, they give you an ingot. It's a perfect way to steadily gain resources without having to risk yourself in the mines. Um, so thank you very much to SilverSpy01, uh, for telling me that, and Sky Silverwing. Um, oh, I'll just sleep. Uh, Sky Silverwing, a convenient way I've found to farm ore berries is to make an underground room three blocks wide and three blocks tall in the middle and two blocks tall on either side as deep as necessary. Plant the ore bushes on either side and a line in the middle with slabs to prevent mobs from storming in the darkness as well as prevent you from touching the bushes and getting hurt on accident. Uh, ore berries make nuggets, uh, to make ingots. Nine nuggets make an ingot. Okay, so, um... So we'll, we'll see, we'll see that in a second, but I might also kind of raid and steal. Because if I can manage to get this hammer made, then I can replace the iron that I'm going to steal uh, from, or oh, it's gonna, oh, oh, I could just, one, two, three. Okay, sorry, Brit, I'm gonna steal your, okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna return your iron orberry, and uh, thanks, I will, I'll make sure you get a hammer first, because, sorry. I, I know, it's not it's not in the code. I didn't mean to steal. Well, actually, we don't have any rules about that, but I just, you know, would feel like a jackass. Okay, I also needed my bricks, so uh, excuse me one second while I run up to the house and go get those bricks. Okay, so I made my uh, seared bricks out of my seared bricks. <clears throat> uh, so let's make that tool forge. We can make fancier ones, but I'm not spending like diamond, blocks of diamonds and emeralds on this, especially not in this crazy world. Um, so we're just gonna go for the bog standard iron legs. Uh, so there we go, and then bang, and we have a tool forge. Da, 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 da. This is when I turn around and realize there was a tool forge here all along. Um, maybe she just didn't fit it in because she couldn't, like, I don't know. I think what I will do is I'll move. Actually, no, that's quite nice there. Screw it, I'm just gonna put it there for now. Uh, so this is what we need for the hammer. So, natural effects are, area effect is three by three, not nine by nine, that'd be crazy. Um, and it's pretty highly durable. So, I need to make a tough rod, a hammerhead, and two, I think, heavy duty plates. So if we go back to the stencil table, uh, and look for large plate pattern, so we'll get that, and we need to make, is that the tough one? Okay, so that's a tough rod, and let's see if we just click randomly and find the, Hammer, head, GUI not being very visible right now. Uh, creeper, that, that, no, there, no. It's gotta be here somewhere. Keep going. Where is it? 
Here's the hammerhead pattern is the. Okay, so these are the basic things we need to make casts. So now, what we do now, now that we've got this bit, is we go to the pad builder, put this thing in here, and we put some cobblestone in here, so we get a stone hammerhead. Now, all of this kind of is very resource heavy, and the better resources you put into this, the kind of better stats your final thing will have, um, tool or weapon or whatever will have. But because I'm kind of, you know, very basic resources at the moment, and I just want to get a hammer to get started um, and get hammers for everybody, um, I'm just going to go for stone at the moment. So this isn't like the best way of doing this, um, but it's a way of doing this just to kind of get off the ground um, before I kind of research the better um, bits and pieces. So what I do, I'm going to do next is after I've made the stone like uh, casts, as it were, uh, is put that there. Make sure I've got aluminium brass down on the bottom there. Hopefully I've got enough to make these bits and pieces. So this is going to make the cast. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, so now we have a cast. So we're going to do this again for the hammerhead. Uh, wait, no, that's not the one. Uh, hold on, let me just drop... Uh, yeah, what am I doing? Yeah, sorry, just getting a bit confused. Uh, I'm just going to put these patterns back. Can I put that one on? Uh, no. Uh, where's the other pattern? What was the other pattern? It was the creeper. I don't know where it's gone. Oh well. C'est la vie. Uh, and then we're going to put that one, and then we're going to put the plate in, so we get a little creeper face. But I don't know why the plate has a creeper face. Like, it's, you know, you could have probably put better ones on there. Oh, please don't tell me I'm out of resources already. No, it's fine. It's, it seems to be enough. You're not gonna, not gonna. There, oh, there we go. It just uh, covered up weirdly. Uh, and so we've made that, we've made that, and we need the hammerhead now. So bam, bam. So thank God I have enough to do all of this because I would have cried if I had to go back down into Dem Mines uh, to do this all again. Uh, so there we go. So we've got these parts. Uh, so that's all good for that. So now what we start doing is picking a resource um, to basically make all these bits out of. So as you can see here, we can have like a copper hammer, which is five attack damage, which is not really what I want. Uh, iron bone paper, um, various ones. Uh, so I think I'm gonna, since I'm kind of low, what have I got as, I don't really have much as ores. I might make it as copper, just to see for now. Uh, so if I, do I have enough? That should be enough. So I'm gonna pour this out. Like so. Is that enough? You got enough? I really like that animation. That is cool animation when it drains out. Yeah, that should be about enough. You gonna finish? Keep going. Keep going, keep going. So like I said, this isn't like the best way of doing this. It's not, it's definitely not the best resource by far, but um, it's kind of a resource. Um, so, you know, cause I want to get the better um, bits and pieces and uh, better iron or uh, not iron or better ores and stuff like that. And um, we'll get there, we will get there. Uh, so shall I just put this on this bookcase? Yeah, I can put that on the bookcase. Uh, so I've got that. Um, instantly you can like make these hammerheads because hammers and I think a lumber axe are advanced weapon, uh, weapons tools. You can just kind of put them in here as well, um, and, and do it that way. Uh, but you know, this is just one of many ways I'm still learning. I'm still figuring things out. Um, you know, you know, you guys know me, I'm just always figuring stuff out. So, you know, the way I do things is not perhaps the best way of doing it, but it's a way of doing it. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm gonna leave these here for other people. I think these are pretty much like dead now that we've made the casts. Uh, yeah, so I need that one left. So I've got that. Um, and this is quite crucial to what we need to do as well. And so is redstone and flint. I think flint, because they add um, special properties uh, to what we're doing. Do I have enough for this? Because the thing I hate the most is... Hmm, I don't think so. I don't think so. I might have to steal someone's inventory uh, stuff. Or I could make it out of gold. Could make it out of gold. Um, let me see. Okay, let's put this here. I may have to go and borrow someone's someone's ores again. Uh yeah, let's let's go on a little rummage. Although someone here has not claimed the bronze, so do you know what? I'm gonna steal the bronze, cause screw it. You know, everyone for themselves. Um, so I need to melt this down again. So we're going to melt that away. 
hopefully got enough full. Uh, full? Fuel. Yami wants me to go to sleep. So I got to sleep now. And we'll see you in the morning when we're almost there with our first hammer. Okay, so I'm making the bronze uh, thingamajiggies, cast plates. Um, and then we'll be able to put the first hammer together. So like I said, like the way I've done it today is not the best way of putting these together and it won't, this hammer won't have the best stats ever, but I just need something to basically go down in the mines. I actually, because I, I logged into um, Nano's village because I got a smeltery there where I kind of taught all this stuff to myself uh, last year and then promptly forgot it all. Um, but I, I genuinely found, like, I know a lot of people ignore the books that pop up, like, when you log in, but I genuinely do think Materials um, by Skylar is, like, one of the more comprehensive books that kind of breaks the whole Tinker's Construct um, thing down. Um, so I might leave this here and, and leave a sign saying read these books and oh I've been given another one mighty smelting make the most of your smeltery um so these are like generally I think I think tinkers and the smeltery is kind of one of my favorite mods um because it does kind of you know it, it's really fun and um I can't get enough of the hammer uh so then after we've done that so if we go back to the tool forge and then click on that so we put together our um thingamajiggy so hopefully this will all just go together. And there we go, we've got our uh, rather orange hammer. So I'm gonna call it Iron Brew. Is that how you spell Iron Brew? It's not, is it? Oh, okay, he's gonna kill me. Iron Brew. Wait, no, it is how you spell Iron Brew. So yeah, we're gonna call it Iron Brew. Um, and then, so that is my first one. The stats aren't great on it, but that'll do for now. Now, the next thing I wanna do is add some stuff to it. So if we go to the tool station, uh, you can basically add things to it. So I'm gonna add moss, which um, basically adds auto repair to it, um, which means that instead of breaking, this hammer will actually fix itself. Um, so, and I think if you add redstone as well, okay, I think one at a time. So we've got that one to start with. Uh, redstone adds like an attack modifier to it. Uh, no, it adds haste. I'm sorry, it adds haste. Um, so I'm not going to add too much in case it just takes it all. Uh, so I'm going to add haste. Um, but yeah, like I said, there are so many like different materials. Like I think flint does something as well. I'm not sure I can add anything else to it. I think flint you can add at the kind of base stage. Um, but there we go. So we've got our first hammer, which means I can go down and... Uh, and basically smash the crap out of things. Um, so for anyone who doesn't know what a hammer does, I'll give a little demo. Actually, I'll head up to my hut because I need to pick up a few things. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to make a few more uh, hammers for everybody and um, leave a note for them all uh, to share out and stuff like that. And then I'm going to go down into the mines and get some more uh, resources. Ooh, uh, that cow just scared the crap out of me. Um, just to pay back um, Brit for the iron that I stole from her and um, yeah, just get things underway basically. Um, there was a mine shaft around here somewhere. Uh, screw it actually, because I wanted to build a basement in my house and it's getting to night. So this will just basically um, smash, do that. So yeah, it's a really good um, tool to have and one that will make mining a hell of a lot more fun. Um, so yeah, so that was my first little kind of, it's not the best way to do it. Like I said, I'm not great at this. Um, people in comments will probably be able to tell you kind of the ins and outs of the best materials and stuff like that. But as far as I'm concerned, I've achieved exactly what I wanted to in that I've put together this, um, and I can go and mine for better resources now. So like I said, I wanted to give back to the village. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a whole bunch of these and then hand them out like free sweeties and um, just pay people back for the kind of looking after me and um, being nice and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I'll see you after the jump cut when hopefully I leave my present for everyone. Okay guys, so I've been busy making my hammers. I only had enough to make three and then I ran out of um, mossy stone to make um, auto repair on one of those three. So I gave Scott that one because I think he's pretty large and in charge. He knows what he's doing. Um, I gave the other hammer to Brit and a note is saying I owe you three iron blocks. Thank you very much, Brit. And finally, uh, I'm gonna give Victoria. So I finished off her iron block. Um, I basically took a, an ingot off of, uh, I broke one of my blocks, melt, smelted an ingot, put it back together for her. Um, and I also given her Fanta Smash. Um, 
and basically left a note for everyone to see what uh, what's going on. Uh, so that's what I wanted to achieve uh, in this episode. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go mining maybe off camera. Uh, let me know if you want to see it on camera or off camera or maybe on a stream. Um, and then I'm going to get some more resources. And so um, I'm also going to plant some orberry bushes as uh, those guys on Reddit told me to. And then my next aim is really to tool up so I can go to the nether um, so that I can get some blades rods because if I get some blades rods then I can make some potions and um, hopefully make some health regen potions and get this show on the road. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with how today's gone. Um, yeah, if you like this series then please hit like and subscribe and support this channel and please make sure to watch everybody else's perspectives. Um, links to all their channels are in the video description below. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for joining me guys and if you've got any feedback on, on, on what to do or how to survive or anything like that, head on over to my subreddit as well. Uh, links in the video description below again. Um, but yeah, cheerio guys!